Thank you, thank you. Anything for the man of the house. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Allison Cruz. Welcome back to Hades. What's going on here? I don't have feet anymore. I died of old age. What's the deal with that? Also, have you? Hypnos. Conversing as always. And if you ever need anything at all, your royalness, you can always find me wide awake right over there. Though I really shouldn't leave my post like this. Not even for you. <laughs> I truly appreciate it. You know, something that I just realized is that Hypnos looks exactly like me. My eyes are always at like a half crescent and I wake up and this is what my hair looks like because I have like my eye blinds just like shifted right above them. <laughs> I don't know, man. How's it going, Pops? Father, have you ever considered that Orpheus might be much better as a court musician if you permitted him to see his muse again? I have considered many possibilities, boy. And I trust Orpheus considered many possibilities before he signed away his rights to see his so-called muse when once he invaded my realm. So you're forcing him to stay here for eternity just because he signed a contract with you? Contracts with me are binding. Until such time as they dig themselves out of the archives and tear themselves up. And I don't see that happening anytime soon. <sighs> Who knows? They might surprise you. Nobody holds a grudge like a crusty old man. And if it was that easy, I'd be spending all my time in there. Um, before we speak to Orpheus, of which we had a conversation with, Thanatos. What? Answer me something, Zagreus. What am I to you exactly, as of late? Because sometimes with you, I... Ugh. I'm sometimes at a loss myself, Thanatos. The one thing I know is it's always really good running into you out there. It's, well, exciting. Sparring with you and all that. And then I know it means that I might get to see you here. Well, here I am. But you didn't answer my question. So you know something? Forget I asked. I've got to go. Wait. Ugh. There is no winning with that poor soul. Now we're going to step into the administrative chambers once again, and I just want to double check some stuff here. Interesting. Because I feel like something massive should be happening here soon, no? Anyway. At least you're not working with me, though, right? <laughs> oh, they didn't show me the faces. That's unfortunate. All right. Well, just wanted a sneak peek in there, just in case. They keep mentioning the archives, so I just want to make sure that we're not missing anything. And speaking of... I don't have enough darkness for this, nor will I ever, but sometimes things will change. Are you okay? Why did you look upset at me? <laughs> I did nothing to instigate that response from you, I'm sorry to say. No Achilles, and I cannot speak to these two chatterboxes, so Orpheus, how do you do, my friend? I am indebted to you, Zagreus, both for your friendship and embarrassment of generosity. And I, in turn, am indebted to you, Orpheus for your calm demeanor and ability to accept life's greatest challenges. You inspire me, and I wish you the best. Oh, they're so good to each other. Say, Orpheus, Eurydice told me your songs. Some of them came from her. She seems quite brilliant. You choose your muse as well. I owe my everything to my Eurydice. She authored many of my songs indeed, and she inspired many, many more. Whilst living, we collaborated frequently, you see. But weren't you the famous one? I don't understand why she doesn't share your renown. It is but one of life's injustices, I fear. I always sang her praises every chance I had, and she asserted herself splendidly. Yet even still, our listeners believed our songs, they came from me. What else could I have done? I don't exactly know the ways of mortals, mate, but I'm pleased to hear you always giving credit where it's due. I know no other way, my friend. <sighs> Alright, well, we got quite a few bagel bites in the last part, so let's go and drop them off. Do what you will with these, my good chef. Look at that. Ooh. Done deal. Oh, that was solid, man. Alright. So, I think I'm probably okay. I don't need to give up 25 for three keys. Um... Do I need anything else? I'm doing quite well on diamonds uh, as it stands and ambrosia, which I should probably start doling out a little bit more frequently. But once that gate opens, it's just like floodgates of ambrosia. Good for Achilles. 
Indeed. <laughs> also, there's. I should probably see. Can we? Perhaps a song would be in order at this time. I want to listen to more music in here because usually I have some going, but it's like they're so expensive, and I don't know. Yeah, in the blood would be the good one, but we don't need to hear it all the time. I think I showed it off before, like a while back, and it was just incredibly loud. So maybe we won't do that on second thought. How's it going, Nyx? No gift which you could bring me can exceed the value of our kinship, child. Though it moves me to receive this offering. It's nothing, Nyx, really. I know you've always believed in me, and it's not something I ever take for granted. I am grateful. As am I. Nyx, I hate to be a bother, but I wanted to ask you about Chaos once again. Won't you at least try to reach out to them? It is for Chaos to reach out to me if they wish to reacquaint themselves with me. Child, it would please me if we spoke no more of this for now. I see. I'm sorry to have troubled you. Fair enough, I suppose. It would be hard to be in love with a primordial being, you know. The garden looks like it's in tip-top shape, so let's head into the bedroom. And no surprise visitors, but we actually did quite a few prophecies. Pleasure Three of them. You, oh my god. So Zeus, you're done. Lord Uncle Zeus sure has been generous. Chaos, you're done. I think Master Chaos just likes messing with me. And the aspect of Rama. Celestial Sharonga. It was my honor. Indeed. Oh man. We just... <laughs> that was a lot. That was a lot of good stuff. Uh, we don't have nearly enough of anything to do uh, what I want here. Although, I was thinking about it. Let me see something. Boiling blood, which has been incredibly helpful over the course of our fights with uh, Hades. Yeah, I think we're probably fine. Okay, never mind. That having been said and done, let's go and take a look at our new weapon of the day. What's on the docket? They always come back. Indeed we do. Back to Exagriff. Man, we have been threading the needle with not getting the Spearman, but uh, unfortunately, I have returned. we should probably switch to the aspect of Hestia, mostly because we've already run Eris two times in a row, and I don't really want to do the regular aspect. It's just not very good, so... Again, we are going to be playing the Reload and Dash game. Only your first shot will be empowered, at which point you just go ahead and uh, do some amazing amounts of damage. There you go. And to help supplement this, I don't exactly know what I would like to do. Because Artemis always sounds nice, but we're mostly going to be struggling with focusing on attack. And Aphrodite might actually be the way to go here. Um, I wouldn't mind Athena, but let's let's go with this and see how it goes, and uh, hopefully we can make some magic happen with that. Otherwise, past punishment, these might end up being pretty gnarly, although we are pretty close to getting our third extreme measures, and then potentially seeing Poseidon after that fight, but um, I think we'll just go ahead and take our benefits package and make our way out with the rail, hopefully. Time to break out of here. Another vermin outbreak near the surface, then. Would that I had someone dependable to deal with it. Where are those blasted satyrs coming from, and to what end? The vile things. Guess I'll see what I can do about it, Father. We will officially become the, the House Exterminator. Now, Aphrodite, please show me something sweet. Lady Aphrodite. I'm afraid there really isn't much here worthy of you, but perhaps this can suffice. Oh my, but if this isn't such a treasure to behold, and I accept it as a sign of your affection, of something even more, perhaps? Um, no, not exactly. <laughs> Little godling, you must know that the heart has infinite capacity for empathy, and I so feel for you there that I have mustered for you some of the most beautiful blessings I can offer. Wow, she was not joking. Oh my god, but of course the attack is not there. Do I dare tempt fate? How about a different set of choices then? Yes! Oh my god! 
epics for days. Thank you. Oh my god. That might have saved the run. Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, seriously? I would have loved to have taken Erebus, but not in favor of Daedalus. Too many S's here in Hades. All right, so we're gonna be playing the dash and shoot, reload, doing all that stuff. Seems like a waste of ammo, if you ask me. Let's see how we can modify the rail. Oh, interesting. So we have never gotten explosive fire, because I feel like this is one of my go-tos. We tried the Delta Chamber once, and never having to reload completely renders this weapon useless. So it's pretty easy. Let's see how this goes. Uh, and we get our faded persuasion back. That is lovely, isn't it? And I wish that my uh, stuff carried over, like um, my reload buff. <laughs> yeah, for the small enemies, we probably don't have to worry too much about it. Oh. oh my god, both fantastic, but Artemis, this is who I want. <laughs> this is gonna be dumb, isn't it? It's gonna be so dumb. Okay, you guys are all in here, so I probably don't have to worry about that either. Good for easy clears, but thank you. I'm trying to decide, special or dash? It is hard to say, no. but man, at least we are getting Lady stuff Artemis. that works. Well, look at you with Exegriff, the Rail of Adamant. Seems much too noisy complicated as a hunting weapon when you could just use a nice quiet bow, but hey, to each her own. Yeah, that's fair. Um, well, pressure points is kind of what I was looking for. I wanted to see another screen full of epics, but that's fine. Uh, uh yeah, we'll, we'll be good with that. And we've got choices. Okay, no chaos, no second Erebus. That's fine. Hopefully we'll be going back down there at some point. If not, that's cool. I'm, I'm fine with that. Hello, it's good to see you all. Thank you. <laughs> and speaking of chaos. All right, which is of the bitchy variety. Thank you. We've got coin or chaos. Gee, I wonder. Going in. All right, let's hope for something on attack. I sense that something is the matter, son of Hades. Speak then. What is on your mind? I can decipher some of it without your telling. I would rather hear it from you voluntarily. Um, Master Chaos, the goddess Nyx, she seems to want to speak with you again. I wonder, would you maybe contact her sometime? She seems convinced it is your move to make if you so choose. The goddess Nyx wishes to hear from me. Now that is unexpected, son of Hades. And I wonder if perhaps this is a jest of yours. Though your intentions evidently are sincere, then I shall make no promises in this, except that I am considering the possibility. Wow, that is a character arc if I ever saw it myself. Um, as far as this is concerned, none of these are that great. I think if I have this, that might increase my power. That's what I'm going to assume. I don't want to waste my Faded Persuasion so soon after getting it, so we'll try that. Ooh, I could palm it up, but let's go and visit Old Athena. Let's see what we got. Oh, it's this one. All right. Oh, you're going to spawn friends too. Oh, right, because you're uh, middle management. I remember. Thank you for just waiting there. And okay. Stay out of my way next time. Cousin, you've met Aphrodite now. She likes beguiling others with her charms, but her intentions with you, I believe, are pure. You'll find our strengths are complementary. Complimentary indeed. You know what? I'll probably go ahead and take the failing shot. It does not fail. Me at least. So that's nice. Um, get another faded persuasion. Call it good. You know, I've been passing up a lot of darkness lately, but I think we're all right. Okay, okay, okay. Stay back, sir. Thank you. Here. Where's your friend? Where's your sweaty companion? There we go. Okay. Yeah, some palms on this thing might be good. Ooh. All right. 
got some of these now. Get back, all of you fiends. Nice. Thank you. Man, I should have maybe leveled this up at least once. Now what? Oh man. I wonder. <laughs> Charon, where I'm probably not gonna buy anything, or Artemis? Do not presume that you escape my notice, boy. Okay, well, it seems like we have turned this into a I bit of a promise. tradition going into one of these rooms early on and just, you know, uh, twiddling our thumbs for a solid 45 seconds. This is great. Fantastic. I wonder if these rooms ever appear while you have, uh, whatever it's called. Uh, I think it was like, it's whatever causes you the Pact of Punishment to, you know, beat the game fast, essentially. Like, level one is nine minutes per stage, which is extremely doable, but I just can't remember which one it was called. It's not like, I don't know, I'm not even going to try to remember. It's so obvious, too. And we are done. Again, you make a mockery of me. In the name of Hades. It's one of my favorite pastimes. Okay, this is unfortunate because none of these are really all that good. I'll go ahead and use this. Hope for something decent. How about a different set of choices? You know what? I'll take clean kill, actually. I was going to go ahead and pop on the uh, special, but that's fine. Rarely have to use it. Um, you know, I'll take some shmoney. Might need some, uh, some of that later on. Oof. Okay. Okay. And some of this, some of that. I was aiming for, but that is fine. Here. Damn it, I suppose. Oh! Of chaos has been lifted. I completely forgot about that because our friend Sisyphus has revealed himself to us. Hello, your highness. Hello, Hello sir. Who's talking? You know, I was just thinking, sir. Sometimes I am a little envious of you and Baldy there. You seem to have things pretty figured out. I still grow frustrated with myself quite often and don't always know whom to turn to. Oh, <laughs> well, I just think you're in a tough spot lately, Prince. But you'll get through. As for old Baldy, why, by all means, do not hesitate to lay your troubles on him if you like. I dumped all of mine on him a while back. So I can just walk up and talk to him and chat? That's all it takes? That's truly all it takes to make a friend sometimes, indeed, Highness. Now here. Oh, that is adorable. Once again, we will go and take darkness, the most permanent thing we can grab here. And can I? I can talk to Baldy? Um, Baldy, I'm Zagreus. Good to make your acquaintance. I know that friends are difficult to come by here in Tartarus, and so I'm grateful that you seem to be a trusty one. Okay. Oh. I think he likes you. And I think I like him. Oh, Boldy. The beginning of a new relationship. All right. Let's see. We got some of these guys. Not who I was aiming at, unsurprisingly. And that's fine. Oof. Anyone else care to join the fray? Here, we'll do some of that. That guy just like went right in front of me. Didn't ask me for that. Thank you. Okay, nice. And we got the level up right before the boss. Anything I need? Uh, yeah, let's go and take that. I think we're set though. And it did look like the dash strike did work with my empowered shot, so that's not bad actually. All right, Kron, you got Dionysus. Oh, I don't care much, I don't want any of that. Sisters, <laughs> what do you got for me? You again. Let's get to work, Red Blood. What do you say? Me? I say you've kept this girl waiting long enough. Well, I say I don't appreciate you calling me Red Blood. You're making me rather self-conscious about it, you know? <laughs> You're funny. But you'll break. They always do. I mean, not always, but maybe with this aspect of Hestia, that's more than likely to happen here. So, she's gonna be in her shield half the time, which gives Meg ample time to go and just smoke me, but luckily we can just go ahead and mm, get some of those shots in there, yeah. Just wait, gentle, ooh, should've hit me, but for some reason it didn't, oh. Man, what is going on? Yeah, I know, I am confused too. You, your rage 
gauge just filled like nobody's business. What the hell? Well, no issues. See you later. Got her. The tactics are real, my friend. Ah, oh, beautiful. That was a good run, especially with Eric. Or rather, with uh, what I got. Yeah. Time for a sweet drink. And... Ooh, a skeletal lure. We have yet to find any, but I'll go and wait. Chances are we might find it. And I think we're fine on that. So, as far as things are concerned, I don't know if there's anything that I'm dying for from Artemis. There's a couple of other synchronicities we can make, but I'm going to try and get some dashes or maybe even the special from Athena just because there is a pretty good chance we could get stuff versus maybe also getting Poseidon. But if anything, I want to save that for Elysium so that we can at least uh, justify the amount of rooms that are there in comparison. Um, I don't think this would be any good on there. And I can't think of wanting to replace my cast with anything else. So let's we'll stick with that and... Hope we've regret nothing. Closer to the surface. Yes. All right. Be there soon, Lurny. Yes, we will. Our new friend learns the Learnmeister. Man, we didn't pick up a single heart back there in Tartarus. That's pretty impressive. Bye. Okay. Let's see now. Not running Eris. Don't forget. Yeah, nice. Some of that. Yeah, look at that. 611. Could be worse, I suppose. Uh, don't like any of that stuff you guys have got going on. Here, something like that. Stay back. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, nice. 